an apology video. I'm not, I swear. I'm not, I'm not filming an apology video. But, um, today, what we're going to be doing, Today what we're going to be doing is creating, pack, wrapping my Christmas gifts because it's Christmas week and I need to get a move on those. So <laughs> here's the thing also, I still have to buy my friends gifts. So that's a bit an issue. Um, but we're not gonna worry about that. And we're gonna worry about that later. Later today, we're going to Target and buy something. But right now, um, what I worry about is wrapping the gifts I already have because I bought my girlfriend a bunch of gifts and she came over and my door to my room was wide open and you could almost see all the gifts that I gave her. <laughs> and I don't want that to happen. So um, we're gonna wrap them today because otherwise I'll lose my mind. Also, on a slip of a side note, when she did came, come over, we built this little, we built the 007 car together. Of course, I, I dumbass, I dropped it and I accidentally broke a piece of it off and I, I, I don't know how to put it back on, but it's okay. I can always look back later and that's a problem for later. I'm putting it away from the edge of my desk now. My mom leave the Christmas wrapping paper at home because she left it in the If she did, um, this is going to be a bit of a problem. Let me, let me check. All right. She hasn't replied to me yet. She's at work. So if she did not have the paper, I can only film this later. But that's a problem for later. But let me show you what I got people because I feel like that's a, that's a fun thing, you know. So this is a gift from my dad and my mom. So, I got him this really cool, like, Levi jean jacket. I didn't realize after I bought it that there's rips in it. But you know what? He's a rebellious. He's rebellious, um, old man. He can, he can, he can wear this. I think it's really cute. And I think he'll wear that. Um, that's it's number one. Then for my mother, I got her this cute Levi's handbag because it's made out of leather. It's really well done. And I had one of these in like peach. Um, but I think she, she's been eating like a lot of small, like a lot more smaller bags because she only has big bags in her life. And I, I wanted to get her something smaller. She just, she just, just Poor girl doesn't have it. I would open this to show you like the handles and stuff, but I want to keep it shut to close. I, I took off just the price tag on these so they can return it if they want to, which would be really mean, but they wouldn't, but you know, just in case. So those are my parents' gifts. <laughs> that you can take off and use um and it has a little heart in the middle that totally is not awfully cut um and whatever and this one is the original one i made um i know you can probably can't see it but i'm gonna take some close-up shots in a minute um but it's like i just realized my girlfriend might be watching this i'm gonna put a big blaring red sign like flashing before I started, because I just realized my girlfriend could be watching this because she watches all my videos. Don't watch it! Turn away! Don't watch this! This one like, oh, Please. Um, then we have this little wood moment that I painted myself. What? I don't know anything about Star Wars, but she loves Star Wars. So I painted us some Star Wars themed thing, which is pretty cool. I'm pretty cool guys, I know. So anyways, <laughs> speaking of Star Wars, I also got her this Millennium Falcon die cast. Um why? Because I thought she would enjoy it. And also it's really cute. It's really tiny. My mom saw it in the store and they were like, Do you want me to get this for her? I'm like, yes, give it to me. So <laughs> Safe. <laughs> Next I got 
got her a Boba Fett figure from the Book of Boba Fett. I have not seen this series. I've seen The Mandalorian, but I haven't seen this series because I'm, I'm not into Star Wars. But, I don't know. I thought it was a cute figure and, you know, I thought she would like it. Then, I got her this Celebrations Pokemon card pack box thing. Um, because she loves Pokemon cards. I also am addicted to Pokemon cards. Um, and we're just... I'm giving her, I'm fueling her addiction. Woo! I also got a Doctor Strange figure, and here's the reason why it's not a rookie object, right? Um, I, I, I was planning on buying it after work and getting it today. Buying it after work and then taking it back home when I get back, right? And then wrapping it up and doing this video. However, my daughter decided to surprise me at work and I bought the figure and I didn't really hide a big box. So I just gave it to her early. Here's a picture of it on her desk. She loves it. She talks about it all the time and I'm very happy that she loves it. But you know, it's really funny. <laughs> that's a funny, that's a funny thing that happened. Um, but here's, but these are all the gifts I have. And I feel like it's still not enough, but th that's what we're going to start with, you know what I mean? I can't wrap them now because the paper the, the Christmas papers in my mom's car. She texted me while I was filming. So, I guess I'll see you when we go to Target. <laughs> I don't know. Update. <laughs> Why is the flash on? But I finished wrapping my girlfriend's gifts and my parents' gifts already wrapped and under the tree and I totally forgot to film it. Um, you can see the mess that my bed is. Um, but I played The Sims for a bit, laid in my bed, and now here I am. Here's the reality of what I do, and hence why I don't vlog. I didn't even go to Target today. I didn't even get to go to Target today um, to get new books, but it's okay. We're living. We are, oh my god, we are living. I, I hate that the flash is on. Now here's the deal. I, since I already wrapped everything, this week's gonna be pretty boring. I, <laughs> I'm gonna be really, this week's gonna be pretty boring. Um, on Thursday is our one month anniversary and we're gonna do some we're gonna hang out together It's gonna be so fun and I am going to force the camera off on her. I'm kidding. I love her too much to do that. However, um, if she's if she allows me to record her reaction to the gifts, I'll be very happy. You know what I mean? Um, anything else I'm planning for this week? I am also hoping to next tomorrow to convince my mother to let me, moi, go to Target so I can get those books I really want. I have a very long to-be-read list that I need to get to. I also started logging my books, hence why my books is on my bed, are on my bed. Um, hence my book, why my books. I'm using this app called Lib, something Lib, and I don't remember what's on my head, but it, it's an app where you can log all your books and stuff. It's kind of like your own personal catalog for all your books, video games, um, vinyls, etc. If you have a lot of those, and I want to start getting into like, I want to get a shelf to place right there under where my little like orange sign is. I'm gonna start placing my books up there, my manga. Bro, it's gonna be so hype. It's gonna be so hype. I have not that many books, but I want to get more. My favorite book right now is literally Loki. I need I need more experience. You know what I mean? Um, and I have a TB read TBR list. And I'm hoping to get three books um, tomorrow, if possible. Um, yeah, that's um, that's it, babe. I, I, I that's my plan. That's my plan. I keep saying this is that this is my plan, but I also it really depends on if I can get the car tomorrow. If I get the car tomorrow, I will go to Target and buy books. I'm so pumped. I have, you know, I have a lot of books that I haven't started reading yet, um, and, like, I know, but it's, like, I'm not interested in those books anymore. I want new ones, you know what I mean? I put this, like, big crate as a Christmas gift, um, and I'm putting all my books in here because where it used to be, it would be in that, in, like, a shelving unit over there, but I think it'd be cuter if it was in here. So I'm going to show you all my books I have, I guess, while I'm here. I have um, 
After School 0123 of Toy Bon Hanukkah Kim. I have The Lost Hero and ah, Son of Neptune. Then I have A Casa de Dragões, which is a Portuguese version of the Kira books. Then we have another Brazilian book, Se a Casa Oito Falas. Then I have an Agatha Christie book, and no one, no one, it, no one's left, or uh, no one's left behind, or something. It's pretty good. And that's it. Those are all my books. That's what I mean by I need more books because look at this sad, sad disarray of books. Um, I'm hoping to like fill this crate up to the point where I have to get a shelf. You know what I mean? So I'm very excited. Good morning. It's the next morning. I forgot. To film, but I, me and my friends just made a podcast, and we're um, and I am about to start uploading it to the drive, so they can start, you know, editing it and whatever. The reason I stuttered twice. I don't have twenty four hours. Get me out of here. So my plans for today. Originally, I was going to go and buy some stuff at Target, but apparently we're having a party tonight. Uh, my mom's co-workers are coming over for like a secret Santa. I'm gonna be in my room the entire time. So no Target today, I guess. Um, however, my girlfriend is flying back from from New York on tomorrow, which is gonna be so fun and funky. Uh, she's gonna be back in like night time on monday i'm gonna try and stay up to say good night and whatever to her but um hopefully we can hang out you know what i mean because i don't work this week or next week so i am very happy you know very happy i don't know um i'm thinking of starting to do a little bit of different content on this channel because I'm realizing really quickly, I don't know if you realized, my life is pretty boring because most of the time I'm in here doing random things like uploading a podcast onto my drive or wrapping Christmas presents, like normal day-to-day -day life stuff. And it's not that interesting. Um, so I'm thinking of starting to do like more like like scripted videos, like maybe not like skits, but like maybe like commentary videos or like explaining this from this place like um explaining the entire plot of the f mouse series you know like that kind of thing seems interesting to me because i just find that fun um there is gonna still be, be this little these little vlogs you know i i'll still have these it's just you know i need to upload more on this channel <laughs> another thing is i am also thinking right Stay with me here. We're thinking, we're thinking, we're brainstorming um, of becoming like getting books and reviewing books because I feel like that's so fun to me. Um, and like, that's why I really wanted to go to Target so I can get new books to be able to review in this vlog so I can see how I like it. Um, or slash, I'll make another video out of reviewing the books. Um, but yeah, that's pretty much it update <laughs> i bought two books one of which i got three books one of which was free with prime um i got the a touch of darkness um the first book um on prime reading then i got the inheritance games and paperback and i also got a good girl's guide for murder on hardback um the two uh, the two paperbacks slash hardback books are coming in at around two today because I paid for, for one day shipping because I want these now, baby, now, you know? Um, and my Kindle is currently charging so I can start reading A Touch of Darkness. Um, but I may, maybe I'll make these book reviews, uh, the, these book videos or whatever, separate videos, but whatever, you know? impulsive buy this this was justifiable because it's christmas and i um it's my christmas gift to myself so um and that's all i can buy until i get a new job
We live in our best life, babe. Best life ever. Sorry. I bet you guys are tired of man. <laughs> so, <laughs> I, if you don't already, I am a senior in high school and I applied to a bunch of colleges. I just got my reply from Florida Southern. I got in with a scholarship. <laughs> I'm losing my mind. Of course, I'm waiting on my other answers to see where I'm going to finally decide to go to, but... This made my day. This this really made my day. I genuinely thought I wasn't gonna get in. <laughs> it's the next morning. Um, I wanted to give you a little bit of a book update. So I I was I'm still um reading through a touch of darkness. I am on I'm seventy percent through now um which pretty great that's a new record because i've never read books before but i am like okay here's my opinion this is just me being very asexual and understanding like how this works but it's i hate that most of like later stuff between okay spoiler warning first First, first of all, spoiler warnings for A Touch of Darkness. I'll probably make a video reviewing all three of these books that I'm reading, but this is something I need to speak up like now because, sorry, my hands are so shaky. Um, because I, I need to get this out of my chest, you know? Like, the relationship between Hades and Persephone um, at the beginning was really cute. You know, like I could see it happening, like enemies to lovers kind of vibe, kind of vibing with it. And I don't know if it's just me being stupid, but it's like immediately after Hades, it's like, I have a contract with you. You have to build this garden and whatever. And then they suddenly go to like, go to doing the deed like immediately. And now every single like five pages, they're doing the deed somewhere. It has gotten to the point where it's like, even the cute, like, the baking scene where they're, like, baking together and Persephone's teaching him how to bake. Um, it's, like, you know, they, there's still a sexual implications there until Alexa walks in. So it's, like, a lot of this is very sexual, which is not my vibe. I think maybe, maybe I bought this book on a whim without really reading the description because it was a Hades Persephone retelling. Uh, which is my favorite couple in all of mythology. I, uh, but it's like, and also there's, but I won't fault the book only for that. There's also some scenes that I really enjoy. For example, I loved the Orpheus scene where um, Persephone tries to convince Hades to let a Eurydice come back and like, which he said no to, which still upset by. Um, that and and the woman with the, the 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 daughter that was really sick that Hades helped um that was really cute um but it's like all of these scenes where they're together there is some implication of them like having sex like even at the ball I forgot to censor that but it's okay I'll censor it in the video <laughs> Like, at the, there's, like, a ball, right, that they do to celebrate reincarnation of the, the few souls that get to go back to Earth. It's a very awesome ball, and you can see Hades changing his heart towards his souls because of Persephone. But then, like, in the middle, he's like, hey, we should have, you know, I'm like, bro, enjoy the moment, you know, like, and Persephone just goes along with it. Like, I understand this is probably me being just asexual and not understanding the point of just having sex constantly. But it's like, come on, give me some more fluff scenes. This is just too much smut, bro. Too much. Too much. Too much, bro. Too much. I did it. I finished the book. I finished it. Get ready for the review because I'm actually making a video on this. I decided to make a video on it because I realized very quickly that I'm going to have opinions on all three of these. <laughs> also, I just realized I've been wearing the same t-shirt for every single one of these vlogs and I probably look stinky. But I, I promise to you, I promise to you, these vlogs are very like... <laughs> 
So the stuff I wore yesterday, these are my PJs. So, you know, and I'm very comfortable. So anyways, I'm gonna start reading A Good Girl's Guide to Murder and I'm actually gonna start tabbing this one because I couldn't tab my Kindle one for obvious reasons. So I'm very excited to tab this one. Do you know what I feel like doing? Walking. And you know where I want to walk? To the clubhouse. Because I really want to sit and read in a different environment. And also I want to change out of these clothes. So why don't we, as a collective, go and read at the clubhouse? Let's go get changed, best. This is the fit. Um, the reason why I'm wearing my boots is because it's very cold. <laughs> I'm also wearing this jacket just in case, but... I haven't worn these jeans and these like combat kind of giving off combat, you know, but I'm very excited. So we're going to go ahead and go to the clubhouse. <laughs> I forgot my key card. <laughs> I have to walk all the way back and get my key card. And then we can go back. I... I'm very stupid. I'm thinking of giving up. Gonna be real with you? Like... I'm... I'm thinking of just sitting outside in my pool. And reading there, because I just realized there isn't like an indoor. Um, like, area in the clubhouse, but I'll, you know, the, the debate is real, the debate is real, but I am hoping that I can, like, <sighs> you know what, maybe I will go, maybe I will go, this is, this is a new experience for me, okay, we're gonna, we're gonna go, also it's warmer than I thought it was going to be, so I'm not gonna take the jacket with me, I'm gonna take, this is a full fit, officially. So, yeah. Never mind, I couldn't find the key card, so, uh, so I guess our only option is to stay home. I literally got dressed, and I just forgot that my, my mom has the other key card. Never mind, then. I guess I... Mm. I gave up on reading. I got distracted um, and started watching Sneak Snag. Um... <laughs> I might just do that for a little while longer, because that's what I was doing, um, and I was having a fun time. So I would just would watch some sneak snag, maybe eat a snack, because I'm kind of hungry, and if I get back to reading, I might. I have no idea, but, you know, this was a journey, you know, and we went on it together. That's, that's the main, you know, friend, friendships were made. I don't know. I think I'm going to end this vlog here. I know this wasn't really a very eventful vlog, but it's still a vlog nonetheless. Um, keep on lookout for the book review or another vlog maybe, um, because, you know, I want to start uploading more on this channel. And I know I say this every single vlog and, you know, I make jokes about it, but it's true. I do really want to upload and, you know, start becoming an influencer. So, but if you guys enjoyed, please subscribe. That'd be so cool of you and so epic, you know, that'd be so cool. Um, and, you know, all that YouTube stuff of liking and ringing the bell, you know, do all that because you're epic and cool. Um, but yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. Hope you have a nice day. Bye! <laughs>